Dear students uh, from Endurance Engineering Academy, we are conducting our National Scholarship Test 2. So we have already conducted National Scholarship Test 1 in the month of uh, in the month of March. Okay. So again, we are conducting National Scholarship Test uh, 2. And uh, what are all the benefits of uh, writing the scholarship test? You will be getting up to 50 percentage uh, scholarship in our uh, gate courses, gate test series or if you are preparing for uh, any uh, exams, state government exams, TRB courses or TRB test series, okay, whatever you want, that is whatever the courses which we have, okay. So, that is uh, the scholarship will be accessible for any of the full courses or any of the test series, okay, which we offer. So, gate mechanical, gate engineering science for both and also similarly for both the test series, okay. And uh, the syllabus, okay, so everything I was displaying, I was displaying the, what is that, the syllabus, the benefits, everything in the screen, you can just go through that, okay, so that, uh, what is that, you can go through it, right. So, what is the syllabus of this uh, test, that is uh, National Scholarship uh, National uh, scholarship Test, simple, your basic mechanical engineering only, as everyone know that, uh, we are basically from mechanical engineering background, engineering, uh, Endurance Engineering Academy. And uh, that is why we keep basic mechanical engineering, that is uh, engineering mechanics, strength of materials from design part, basic thermodynamics, fluid mechanics and hydraulic machineries from uh, thermal part, mathematics and general aptitude from the general part. Manufacturing and industrial, we are not going to add it in national scholarship test because manufacturing and industrial are, are not the topics which has to be uh, asked in national scholarship test, okay. So, these are the six topics and questions will be uh, like it will be a mixture of easy, a medium and also high level questions and uh, by going through this national scholarship test itself, you will understand how the questions of our test series will be, okay, because uh, the level of national scholarship test will be same as that of how we ask our questions in our test series, okay, right. So, we talked about uh, what are all the benefits of scholarship test and uh, what are all the what are the syllabus and uh, what are the syllabus and uh, what are the level of questions which is going to be there and what about uh, the what about the uh, what is that the questions okay how many questions so totally there is going to be 10 questions okay and it's going to you, you will be having a time of 30 minutes okay 30 minutes 10 questions and the timing and the date okay the so date, date is uh, may 29 and uh, the timing is between 9 to 12 that is from morning 9 until 12 uh, from morning 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. you will be having the access to write the test. So test will be 30 minutes which means you can take uh, 30 minutes from that uh, 3 hours okay from that 3 hours you can take any of the th any any one 30 minutes that is whichever time you are convenient with from 9 to 12 you, you can take the test and the test was happening in Sunday so there won't be an issue I hope most of you will be free most of you that is even if you are going for a job also you will be free during that time so you will able to you will able to attend the test right. Next is uh, what are the important things to keep it in mind. See the the link for this test was added in the description. You can just go and you can register for the test. But what I will suggest is when you are registering, please make sure that you give your working mobile number and mail ID because these two things are going to be important. Because without this, you won't able to receive the notification properly in your mail. And after the test, if suppose if you are going to get any scholarship, that is if you are getting 50% scholarship or 30% scholarship or 10% scholarship, whatever, okay, 15% scholarship, whatever the scholarship amount, if you are going to get the scholarship, then the communication will be made through, uh, what is that, messages and uh, email. So, if your mail ID and uh, your number, your phone number is not, uh, if it is not working or if it is not correct, then you won't able to avail the scholarship, okay, that is a problem. So, thing to note, keep your, uh, what is that, mobile number and the mail ID, uh, working mobile number and working mail ID when you are registering for the uh, test. If there was any issues, for example, you already registered in our portal and you are trying to register for the test, you are not able to uh, register for it. If there was any issues in between when you are trying to register but you are not able to register, register WhatsApp us in the number which is shown. Okay, just WhatsApp us, I will respond to you. Okay, and uh, last and final, uh, the test that is the national scholarship test is not going to be free of cost because we are going to make sure that there is no uh, redundant registrations, okay, no same person registering for more than one time or same person is registering for uh, uh, with a different different names or different things, they are not registering it for more than one time and also we need to make sure only sincere aspirants register for the test series, sorry not for the test series, register for the scholarship test because if, uh, if randomly if we keep the uh, national scholarship uh, test to be free of cost, anyone can register 
and uh, even the students who are not sincere about their preparation they will also register unnecessarily without uh, what is that i will give you an example for example um, 10 students i will give a simple example 10 students are trying to register just for an example and if out of the 10 five students are not interested which means they are not very sincere about the course but they are registering it okay but they are registering it and they got 50 percent scholarship i'm just giving an example because it has happened last time and even before that also okay they got 50 percent scholarship so uh, they have contacted we have mailed them we have called them everything but they are not interested because they are not sincere so they have not registered for the course so unnecessarily the balance five students the first five students who got 50 percent scholarship they are not utilizing it and balance five uh, balance five students uh, they are not able to get 50 percent scholarship so to make sure that the students who are very sincere those who want to register for the course those who are interested to register for the course and they are looking for some scholarship or some offers only them uh, it is suggested only for them to take the uh, take the nature scholarship test because it will make sure that the interested students registered and the deserving student will get uh, the scholarship okay right so that's it uh, i have given you all the details uh, just go through uh, just go through the details if you want in our portal also i am mentioning i'm just giving you the uh, link in the description box okay check it out so prepare well and uh, take the uh, take the scholarship test and uh, all the best